Alright, I'm going to play another game now. This one is Glover from Hasbro again. And James is with me again in this video. Hey everyone! Yep. Hey indeed. Um... Good music. Yeah. And... There's Glover. Look, just... Look what he does. He turns the yellow, the red globe and the logo to his bouncy ball. Interesting. Yeah, quite a little effect and Nintendo published the game in the UK. Um, Why did that look a bit like Mario 64 there? I don't know. Let me just press that. Um, there we go. There's, let's, let's press... Um, <laughs> for some reason I decided to use all the save files. I decided to make them all mine. Um, um, the, the opening cutscene in the game only shows when... Um, you start the game for the first time, so I can't show it to you in this video. Oh, okay. So, so the controls I use the um, D-pad or the um, analog stick to to move. A to jump, double A to double jump. What's with all the red fog in this? Well, basically the the, the um, castle which um, a wizard lives in, um, the crystals have all gone. So. It's turned the world all like that. And uh, you've got to fix it to... S yes, you've got to make sure all the um, bouncy balls are there. I'm just trying to find the... Um, there's Cross Stitch's laugh. That's the... Um, that's Glover's brother who was turned um, bad by a bad potion that the wizard accidentally made. This pipe takes you to the um, practice stage. For some reason, the PS1 version which doesn't have this at all for some reason. Weird. Yeah, there's Miss, Mr. Tip. That's a cool name. Um, so yeah, this game's also on the PC, and the PS1 the PC version's identical to the N64 version, but has a different soundtrack. Huh. So... There you go. So, um... I'd say the idea is very original um, for a platforming game. Yeah. So, I'm just, I'm just trying to find how to bounce the ball. There we go. And Glover can also turn the bouncy ball into different forms as well. find the button how to okay how to turn it into different forms oh there we go We've got a bowling ball which is heavier a ball bearing and then the what, castle's what did you crystal say? Shazam it said wow yeah you've got to be careful with the um castle's crystal otherwise you'll destroy it like hang on just when the when the thing gets destroyed, Glove has a really creepy um scream. Oh, I don't want to hear it then. Okay. okay. Oh, careful. Yeah. You, so let's turn it back into the bouncy ball. Ah, that's better. Um, but the good thing about the um the different forms is that um they they used to solve puzzles. What? Let's just. There you go. Let me just. Because I haven't played this version much as I have with the PlayStation version, even though that one's worse. This, the N I'd say the N64 version is better. Oh, I think I know what to do here. Because if the ball's too, um, because... You got to throw the ball here. Oh. So. 
and see, I like, I'd say the music's good as well. Let me just, oh. Oh, too short. Got to this one seems tricky. Yeah. The game is hard to control. Um, so, let's be careful. Um, there we go. Uh -oh. It's back. It's still. Okay. Yeah. Okay, good. For this bit, you um, need there's a switch here, and if you put Glover's um, mobility on it, then ah, it generates more sand. Yeah, so that um, you can progress through the level. Well, okay, seems a bit overflowing now. And in fact, um, hang on. The Castle Crystal can um, float in water, in deep water. Wow. Whoops. I just hope I don't destroy or otherwise I'll have to hear Glover's horrendous... Oh, Glover can balance on... Um... Yeah, he can balance... Um... Let me just be careful. Quick, change it back, change it back, change it back, change it back. Oh, change it back, change it back. Okay. Quick, change it. Oh, I keep forgetting how to. Oh, there we go. Back to normal. still says Shazam. <laughs> do, is, do you think the Glover's voice is annoying? Not too much. Still, I think he's one of the few that's gonna get a DC Comics score suit. <laughs> Why is that? For Sage Shazam. But the game was released in 1998, so... Ah, oh, yes. Anybody could... do stuff like that, then. Ooh. Too bad we're getting more lawsuits these days. Like, with, um... Like, Nintendo's very protective with their own IP. Uh-huh. They won't ever let us create any fan games. It's kind of like one thing I have against Nintendo. What? What, like, are you, what are you saying about Nintendo? Yeah, like, they don't allow fan games. <laughs> I mean, that's that's actually pretty sad when you think about it. There's actually a good reason why, they, why they're why they so protective against their own IP. The Super Mario Bros. movie. That's the only reason why they're so protective. Really? Yeah, just because that movie bombed. Oh, well, they could just ignore it then. They actually had involvement with that movie, so <laughs> they can't ignore it. So it's basically their own fault. Yeah, mm, that the movie bombed. Still doesn't excuse them from blocking bad games. Oh, not again. I mean, just. Oh, I think I know how to fix this because. Oh, okay. Um, let me just. Whoops. Um. Just trying to bounce the ball. Let me just move the camera. Let's be careful. And then make sure I'm Glover. So then I can turn into this or the ball bearing. The lucky thing, the ball bearing can't break. Oh, so whoops, I keep. I need to press the B button first. So I can bounce it. Oh, I need. Because uh, if that crystal smashes, then it's over. Yeah, you you lose a life anyway. Because even though Glover has a um, 
life mar marker. Um, if the ball is destroyed in any means, then you lose a life, no matter how much your health is. Whoops. Um, let me just. Oh, don't move! Don't move! Ah! <laughs> I'm so confused with the controls. Try again. This time. Hmm. It bounce. There we go. That. Yes. There we go. So I can turn it back into the um. And then we got the last bit of the practice stage in which you have to um I think there's a switch hidden behind here which will because yeah I think there's a switch here I mean I'm gonna try and find it let's see what the um Combining it into bouncing. Try destroying the crates if, if you can do that. Okay. Let's see. Wait, there's a switch there! Oh, where? Right there. What, under there? Yeah. Uh, it's just underwater. No, 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 no. Underneath that crate. Oh, okay. I'll. Go, look at that crate and see how there's a gump there. Okay, I'll destroy it. I'll destroy the crate and. Okay. Yeah, see that? Yeah. There we go. Now all I need to do is throw the ball at the um There's another crane. I bet you would kinda lose a life if you Yeah. If you destroyed the crates before you got the ball up. Yeah, if I used the um, crystal um, thing, then it would have been... Oh. Yeah, but then if you do some of any other ball, it still wouldn't be able to get up to the ledge because you would have nothing mm. to get it up with. Not true. Now, now here's the last part. So... Yeah. There we go. That's this stage is done. Whoops. And see so yeah, it in. So yeah, next time I'm gonna look. We're gonna look at the PS1 version of this game. See so ya. Yeah, see you later, guys. Bye.